So this could have sprawled off, uh, sprawl off into a conversation with governor now. When I say yo, he was giving advice to Joshi and Silk Boss. Basically, he was saying, try be a big artist instead of a hot artist. Seem like in their call for peace. And the fans are saying, fuck off with your peace, brother. <laughs> wow. It was it was met with mixed reactions. You could say that. Why did right? they say that? All right. So for context, as we mentioned, say you um they are called for peace between Joshi and Silk Boss. And I say, oh, Silk Boss, I don't really know you about a Govi Govi attack and rate as an artist, you know, for, you know, in a bag of war or nothing. Now, for pre that, I'm paraphrasing. Yeah. Try to be a big artist, not a hot artist. People were quick to bring up, say, yo, brother, remember, say, you did a this up massacre and them thing there in a past songs. And yeah, them basically clash. Mm. Was there a winner there? We never mentioned that in the lineups of Clash. But it's like, <laughs> come on. But that's even remember it. Exactly. Nobody remembers this shit. I think everybody remember that he was gunning for I don't I don't know. And, and then governor took it. Decided to take it down. Yeah. Yeah, nobody remember that. Mm. You know what they remember? Iman Skeng. Iman Alkaline. I digress. <laughs> <laughs> so people are saying, oh yeah. This is the way I said, brother, it's irrelevant. Make the youth them be youths. Is him is a part of the culture. Mm -hmm. All these things. Then bring up theme pass and say, remember, say, you did I do that. So live and let live. Make them live and learn and do them thing. Why you come try? Is him be the Debbie Downer on our party? We war war. I think Teradon was like 90% <laughs> of this guy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. So what do you think? Me, what do you think about what he had to say? I actually want to know what he meant by big artists and art artists. Mm. Like, he's, I guess he's saying... What's the difference? Artists of the moment, moment versus, versus... Somebody that will live on forever. Yeah. So like, like or, beyond the moment. Because they can be big and art at the same time. You True. can be. You can be, you know, which is a realm in which I think Skeng <laughs> is approaching. Right now. Yeah. Because it's been over a year since in bus, right? Yeah. yeah. And the clip in which he's releasing songs that connect mm -hmm. is at a higher rate. Yes. So I believe it could be argued mm -hmm. that either they are approaching that realm right now. But, you know, like, say, like a Sean Paul, you don't know, big artist yeah. versus a. Sorry for say, but he could be perceived as, or could have been perceived as a hot artist, Rai Jin King. You know, yeah, the time when yeah. he had the run and you know, not, not wrong. He just he had his run and you know, where people that say, "Yo, even him," that say, "I'm here on dance hall." Mm -hmm. I'm sure nobody is really saying that right now, mm -hmm. right? To be fair, mm -hmm. um, so I feel that that's why I'm did a refer to when he said that. So your know, clashing thing is just a part of you know being the hot artist at the moment, and which I I don't think is I don't think is a fair assessment mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. you know all the biggest artists in dance hall. They've clashed mm -hmm. at some point or another. They, they clash. I don't want to make it seem like we are hypocrites, even though we, in some ways we are. Yeah. Um, but we have in the past said, so does clashing make sense? And we've questioned it and like... Well, said, right. Yeah. And that's mm -hmm. why I, I said it up before. Like the society... In regards to the temperature not, and even... It's in, not in, at a state right now where we can... It's conducive to clashing. Even the state of dance out too. Because we're saying the rhythms, them, there's no, there's no juggling yeah. and it's like... I'm, me just fall to pieces. It was just a different time. Yeah. Like yeah. juggling dead. These are all wars that gonna happen now. Mm -hmm. I just saw. Mm -hmm. I've fall to pieces with that mm -hmm. and accepted that. Yep. Um, but dance all changed for what? <clears throat> dance all changed for what? We know it. You know, it has changed mm. dramatically. Yeah, it's true. not. It's not our game anymore. <laughs> Pretty much, it's not our game. Is 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 the same idea as like basketball. Basketball changed from what it was when it started out to what it is now. Yep. You know, it's the same Dread, game. Steph Curry, take it there, you know? Yeah, it's the same game, but it's not what we were used to. Mm. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it's just, we have to accept it for what it is. But for me, personally, <clears throat> like people talk about the culture, the culture, the culture. I'm like, yeah, it's like one aspect of it. Because mm. even in a weird way, well, mm -hmm. it's not weird. The versus thing, it's from Jamaican culture, yeah. you know, and mm -hmm. to see how Americans, how them, well, Swiss and Timbaland, how them 
um extend and Put redefine them. it yeah. in a way but that's literally what it come from it stem from our culture of clashing you mm. know a toast and a clash and whatever go mm-hmm. song for song so yes it's it's it's, <clears throat> it's one aspect of our culture mm. that i don't necessarily want for it to be done with but that's the exciting it's, it's exciting it's, it's, it, yeah it when done to, right when done yeah. in the right parameters it is one of the most thrilling things and especially and most unique aspects yeah, of our culture and it's mm-hmm. and 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 it's just instinctively in us in competition like we're very you know we love competition mm-hmm. and we love pig side if i yeah. if see a war <laughs> we are going we are going instinctively we think that oh and i want they're going to win the war like mm-hmm. two man a fight on the road or oh, that one they're going to win like yeah. uh, if somebody lose we're going to just jump on the next side and yeah. say you know what somebody you know what say you're going it's yeah, yeah, yeah. instinctively like, like oh you're done with skin right yeah <laughs> <laughs> it's instinctively in us uh, to, right. to you know oh, we, when we see that when we see war are going and you know and the people in that dance out mm-hmm. to them instinctively competitive too and then one show said they're the conquering of all conquerors or conquer of all conquerors so it it can i don't mind it i don't yeah. mind war can but, be exciting yeah and it's just that you can't just do it can that can't be just one facet of it because i think the overall complaint is that you can't just be a one faceted artist mm. you can't just be one dimensional like you can't just that be multi-dimensional yeah mm-hmm. like what, what what would and we and i guess we, we we focus on cartel because he is the prototype where he wasn't just a clash artist he wasn't just a bad man artist he was like a girl artist mm-hmm. in the song to like um summer uh, no not not <laughs> pool part you know like I mean, him a yeah. vibe song so he was a multifaceted artist mm-hmm. you know and we celebrate him to this day and even if you know whichever side of the i um kind of fall on like you can you have to respect what he is and that's what i, I think one of the things where I say about Clash, you can't just be one particular thing. Mm. Yeah, there's so much variety and dimensions to music that it it, it, yeah. it is nice that you can almost fit into every part. You're not going to do everything great or excellent, mm-hmm. but if you can do... If you can fit into each mole well, mm. or each dimension, or each side, or facet of dancehall, then, then you'll be a great artist mm-hmm. to me at least personally so that's where i was coming from in terms of like clashing. what you said yeah yeah, yeah. like you can't just be one so, so, something like you gotta get boring after a while like it's okay to fit in and try different things this podcast episode is brought to you by itopia life herbos or cannabis and culture combined for one of a kind experience you can visit them at 10 aos king's house road just across on canadian embassy also you can follow them on instagram or Visit their webpage at itopialife.com for latest info and strains and merch. This podcast is also brought to you by Pure24. Pure natural supplements designed to enhance the body and mind. They make supplements affordable, effective, and easy to use. You can visit their website at pure24store.com. Their product ship all across the world. I don't know so you can use that promo code, The Fix, to get 15% off all purchases. That's promo code, The Fix, to get 15% off all purchases. We also have big up. Rich cuts, barbers for the richest of cuts. Ching! Ching. <laughs> you can go to Rich Cuts Barbers located at Nine Brunch Trough. Square don't know so you can follow the boy Steve right there. Last but not least, we have big up our merch store. We have new merch. Same. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder Same. why somebody didn't decide to wear the merch today as was planned. You know what I mean? <laughs> New merch, you don't know, say, along with the new merch, you can get the black tea, the white logo, the blue tea, the faded logo, the fixed mask, the fixed cup, fixed things merch, as well as our new Zine merch, all Zane. right? Zane? <laughs> Link in the bio. <laughs> Every youth for rich, right? Every youth for rich, right? Um, so big up, Joshy, big up, Skink, for one thing, and me, the youth, I'm for respect, Govi, Govi, Kaz, Govi, Govi, Gotta show all youth some respect. Every ghetto youth can be rich and wealthy. Every ghetto youth will have things and can take care of their family, right? Mm-hmm. So him did approach it from the, the, the aspect there. I'm wondering if it's that he knows that there are elements involved that would take it across the line of just clashing. 
that that's all the, always the fear with, with them thing right? that's yeah, yeah, always, yeah. The fear. always the fear so yeah, I wanna if it's that he must say that self. with that understanding too and not even the artists themselves too are the, are the artists underlings and the fans them who mm. always want push it to why. the next Let level I always want to take it too far yeah. I don't know and if it's at the bidding of the artists you know we never see publicly that they're telling their fans or their their cronies around them to, to take the war further but it always seemed to it not, the vibes just never seem kosher. Mm. <laughs> I think that's that's something over the years from generation to preceding generation has kind of changed. Mm-hmm. Where man them could have clash and you know what I mean and there's nothing past that while it just seemed like with every new generation, it's like it gets violent, changes. violent. Mm-hmm. The possibility of things outside of a lyrical clash mm-hmm. happening, mm-hmm. it increase. Mm-hmm. So it's like all them things you have to keep in mind. Mm-hmm. I mean, I I can definitely. It's like I see this thing in a my quintessential liberal way with, with that sense of balance. Mm. You know what I mean? <laughs> so I see what he's saying, but a part and part of the culture. Yeah. It's part and part. I, 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 I don't know my thoughts on the Josh's sit bass thing. It's like the table was set. Mm-hmm. So, me not see nothing wrong there. So, mm-hmm. to me. Yeah. You know what I mean? But if it's that your things outside of that, I go on then, eh, no bother. Mm-hmm. But the man did have all right to send lyrical shots at this. Year. Yeah. All right. And I mean, it's grateful that. Because Silba seemed to be somebody that's irrational. Mm-hmm. That's, that's by, irrational. Irrational. What do you say? Rational. <laughs> you're no, saying, you're you're saying, irrational. Yeah, oh, yeah. 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 yeah he seems say, very yeah. irrational. He yeah. seems very quick, Ill, ill-tempered mm-hmm. and quick to wrath. Like, you know, so I'm thinking he could have, he could have met it, like, could have be a personal thing and then got to blows and then fight Why? physically. <laughs> They fight physically, you know, Blows. but, you know, true to form as an artist, he, he uh. keep it there. So, I mean, I'm thankful for that. And that I can agree with. Like, I don't mind them, you know, the going back and forth lyrically. But as we said, like the whole vibe of the country mm-hmm. and we'll be hypocrites. And that's what I want to say. Like, that's why people, you know, tear it and ask me if we don't want the war or it's just that, you know. Not now. We're not. We're not ready. <laughs> we're not ready for it. We're Deep not. Don't you know feel like mm-hmm. Sarah? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Hmm. Because as much Harold did as the vibes cartel of other war was, it did spill over to that territory. Yeah, I remember it. Did. The government yeah. did not forget in power and all these mm-hmm. things. So, yeah. mm-hmm. Them people and them fervent fan base and it's like the toxic nature of social mm-hmm. media is like mm-hmm. it could see where it and could go with, pretty And even easily. with the artists them themselves to like. You know, like we're not expect people to be all friends and chummy mm. and hey, we're besties. But you know, like for even for being at the same venue is gonna be a problem for them and mm. them underlings. Like mm. and for sure promoters and yeah, all. Yeah, now gotta like, show the uh, the artists the day and mm. it, bad vibes. It, it, yeah, it's just like oh, children, <laughs> like <laughs> come on. It's I mean, just we laugh, music. We laugh at the boop, boop, boop thing, but honestly, like, it's funny to me, but we, ah! we, we more can't talk right. We can more tolerate it then. And it's just like, it, I don't know, we just, it's a, it's a part of our culture where we probably just have to, I think, say it just did. Mm. Truly, in fact, mm-hmm. it's just that there are not enough mature people in, like, in the, act, the actual artists themselves and the, the fans them themselves. There's mm-hmm. not enough mature people to keep it on that level. Yeah. Truly. So no, I'm not okay. trying to stop your war, Terrell. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, baby. I love you. But you know as well as I do, like this. Yeah, I know you want it. Cause it I only people, you know. people I only put people out there. And it. I and I can get why they want it. Cause it's true. Like it was a fun part of it. Like, especially if you have your if you love your artist, you want you want to say your artists are the best thing and your artists kill that. Like kill that particular art, um rival artist. Mm-hmm. But you know, and it'll come like back in other days, and with that party, and you hear the song, them, yeah. and you know which song I come mm-hmm. from. Like, yeah, no ear song, I'm a no ear song. It was just a oh. vibe, it was fun, it was it's fun. I just yeah. reached up and it wasn't fun anymore. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we got governor, though. I like the mature stance, but mm-hmm. yeah, I could see 
why people would be having mixed reactions to yeah because he, he, he seeing his history and yeah. knowing the history of the culture itself yeah mm-hmm. yeah. yeah can't say really. peace and love love and light <laughs> now i mean fuck everybody <laughs> 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 Clearly, I'm not on that vibe, but yeah, whatever. Boy, I know that you damage, damage. You constantly jam me in no love, no love. You constantly jam me in no love, no love. Oh, big fuck, Ben Spandians. Bad girl, pull up, but she wanna bring friends. Overseas, me day, you never see me back again. She blowing on the gen, this girl is a vent. vent, vent. Big fuck, Ben Spandians. Bad girl, pull up, but she wanna bring friends. Friend, saw me a dog full of red. Yo, bigger them than what will I pay? Lock down in a cell, cast the street for dead. Damn, men can't sleep, this I couldn't a nightmare. Heart put up like weed and prayer. So now come as I'm playing my game.